There's combined inform suffix prefix in medical terminology. To learn them all, there's lots and lots and lots of flashcards you'll agree. To start, you break the words apart and find the word part meaning. From diagnostic imaging to anatomy and physiology. Let's say we have a problem with our heart and need cardiology. They also take a murmur and order ultrasonography. You'll swallow with a transesophageal echocardiography. But maybe you'll be lucky and have an echocardiogram. <laughs> The structure valves and pressures look fine, let's continue with the exam. To look at electrical pathways, we need electrocardiogram. If that looks fine, let's stress it and make it glow with technetium. Capture with a gamma camera, that will be our rule of thumb. <laughs> We'll do a PA light chest x-ray to see what else we can find. Size and shape potential fluid calcium could be outlined. For more detail, a CT could provide us with the calcium score or verify the severity of aortic valve some more. There's always magnetic resonance imaging that we could do. But we can't be claustrophobic with metal and plate that we knew. X-ray comes back into play if we think vessels might have clots. We'll schedule angiography so we can find those little spots. <laughs> But if we're too late to catch a myocardial infarction, VTAC with the pulse, we would start a cardioversion. But with no pulse, we start CPR, need defibrillation. Now she needs a percutaneous coronary intervention. <laughs> like a wide Gumby. <laughs> that? No. <laughs> oh, we gotta do it again? Yes. <laughs> it's bad, is No, my heart. <laughs> 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 